I think that the day school has so many things that it needs to accomplish in such a short amount of time. That extra three hours is really ideal for a child to really kind of find themselves and find what interests them about the world around them. And so I see our space as kind of cultivating that, you know, and um, really showing them what learning can be and how learning can be fun. When I became principal, uh, NYJTL was already established here. So my goal was to maintain that relationship at all costs possible. It's been a wonderful experience. NYJTL has been the partner that helps us support our parents, especially those who are uh, working multiple jobs, single parents. But not only that, it's been the partnership to support the instructional vision of the school, and helps enrich the learning experience of our students. So it's been a wonderful experience. All my children, they've been in the program now four years. It helps me because I get to rest when I'm not at work. I don't have to run around with a babysitter and things like that, so it helps a lot. Darius has been in MYJTL for the last two years, about two years. He does the summer program and the regular day program at school. Um, his hobbies usually are doing like after school crafts with the school, like little arts and crafts, and sometimes they help him with homework and things like that. I definitely see an improvement in his homework. He was struggling to write a little bit, but then he had a little friend that also helped him out along with the teachers that are here. I go to anime class, which I think is very interesting because we draw our own characters from our imagination, we do anime movie reviews, and it's, it's really fun. NYJTL's ACES program covers the crucial period of time after school in that 2.30 to 5.30. I think the work that we're doing for kids in New York City is so crucial. I think that we're offering them the opportunity that to explore, to figure out who they are, uh, whether that happens on the tennis court or in the classroom. I think that we're allowing these children to become the best versions of themselves. NYJTL! My name is Jaden and my favorite subject in school is math. When you're in math, you have to memorize so many things, so many formulas, like addition, subtraction, multiplication, there's coefficients, so many things. I didn't expect to do Crypto Club with working with computers, but now that I do it, it's really fun just to do different types of coding. Three years ago, we started the STEM Expo and it was just honestly a baby of hands-on activities and learning for the participants to engage in in a field trip setting. And it became a monster. <laughs> it, be it became a monster. We started with 20 kids per site and as of this year on our third annual STEAM Expo, we'll be hosting 40 kids per site. The hardest thing for kids, learning social emotional skills. And what we do is we build them into every activity. So if it's art and, and a kid draws outside the line, you know, and they get upset, we say, it's okay, let's try it again. And that helps them develop the perseverance. It's not about getting it perfect, it's about just seeing it through to its conclusion. I've been, I've been thinking, I want you.